Skylar Henry reporting from the Gulf Coast. Let's continue our team coverage now. Sally could dump up to four months worth of rain in all, along the Gulf Coast in just a few days. That is according to the National Hurricane Center. Let's get right to CBS4 Chief Meteorologist Craig Setzer with the latest advisory. Craig. So the new advisory, if there's any good news in it, it is that uh, Sally has not gotten any stronger throughout the day today, maintained an intensity just at low end category one, 80 miles an hour, and just drifting to the north right now at about two miles an hour. That's about an average motion over the last six hours. The pressure has slowly gone down a bit as the wind field has gotten a little bit broader. It hasn't really gotten any stronger, though, and that's certainly good news. 90 miles to the southwest of Pensacola, Florida there. Here are the latest warnings, tropical storm warnings, and then inside of that, an area of hurricane warnings from Biloxi through Mobile and including Pensacola. Here's the uh, threat cone future track. Of course, the cone shows where the center is expected to be, but the weather conditions extend well beyond the cone. That's why we put this yellow area on the map here. That's the area of the tropical storm conditions. It's a very slow motion, likely the center crossing the coast there sometime during the day tomorrow. And then it's a weakening system that moves up over the southeast U.S. Radar through the day today, you can see it's uh, moved just a little bit starting out this uh, six hours ago, right about there. So. We moved about 10 miles over six hours to the northeast, but you can see these strong bands continuing to come on shore there, especially through parts of uh, Alabama as well as much of the Florida Panhandle. Once again, rainfall is going to be the big problem, the biggest problem. Here's the predicted uh, amounts from one computer model, and some areas in this white here could see between 15 and 20 inches of rain in the next two to three days. That's not all we're tracking, of course. We've got Teddy, Vicki, Paulette, and a pretty strong disturbance out there. We'll talk about all that coming up in just a bit.